What an extremely insane game that we just watched here for a preseason game, San Francisco 49ers versus the Denver Broncos. The San Francisco 49ers win with a walk-off kick from Jake Moody. He missed a PAT, and it was pretty interesting because Trey Lance led them all the way down the field. A really good drive by Trey Lance, being able to hit Ronnie Bell. Good run by TDP down to like about the two-yard line. And then they decided to have three kneels in a row to run the clock and give Jake Moody an opportunity to get the game winner. Like in real time, I'm gonna be honest, I was like, oh, ooh, you know, because I didn't want Jake Moody to miss it. I didn't want Jake Moody to go up there, have a game winner right in front of him and miss it. And just, just uh, we knew what was coming if that was gonna happen. But thankfully, Jake Moody put it right down the uprights and the 49ers win in walk-off fashion. And it was really cool because the entire team mobbed Jake Moody. If there was any confidence issues, that is, again, it, it's a, it was a little dicey, but Kyle Shanahan put him in a position to win the game and he did it. And for a young kicker, I, I mean, that's huge. To be able to give him that confidence in that moment to believe in him, to go out there and do it and hit the game winner, absolutely huge. Uh, but this is a crazy game, just absolutely crazy. We saw all three quarterbacks. Brock Purdy got a series. We saw Sam Darnold, who got a lot of reps. And we saw Trey Lance, who got a lot of reps too. Um, and so we'll kind of work through like those guys' performance. The first drive of Brock Purdy, phenomenal. It's just, it's what we've come to expect from Brock Purdy and what we saw in training camp. So nothing that was really by surprise. He operated the offense smoothly, effectively. This music is really loud. Hopefully you can still hear me. Um, but uh, Brock Purdy handled it, that, that entire first drive, really, really well. Almost got down for a score um, down there at the end. They ended up, uh, I believe, kicking that field goal. Uh, but it was only one drive for Brock Purdy and then Man, this music is loud. Uh, then after that, the uh, Sam Donald came in. He played into the second half. Um, Sam looked good. Sam was completing throws. He got sacked a couple times, but he had some really good throws. He had the touchdown pass to rookie Jack Coletto, the fullback out of the backfield. Sam looked pretty good. He looked like after he got some time, he was able to settle in and get it done. And then it was Trey Lance's turn. And Trey Lance started off really, really rocky. And it, it was like, it just wasn't coming together. It looked, it didn't really look good. And then you had the, uh, the interception to the defensive tackle on like the screen. From my perspective, there was a massive brawl that happened two feet away from me in the same row that I was in. Right when I was, we were trying to figure out if it was an interception or not. So like my, like, it completely took my brain off football for about a series or two just because this, this huge brawl broke out right next to me. I mean, dudes were bleeding. It was it was a crazy, it was the craziest fight I've ever personally seen in person. Um, it was it was crazy. So my like I I was like, what's happening? Because I was I would just watched this brawl break out and I'm trying to figure out what's going on with Trey and Lance and but as I started to kind of get back to being able to focus and like realize what's happening, Trey Lance is doing a good job. And you know, like I, I would say he wasn't getting like, there was penalties, there was drop passes, not everything was going his way, but he still kept attacking and you started to see him settle in and he got better and better as the game went on. And that that is what we've seen from Trey Lance with this time with the 49ers. As he is able to let the game play out, he gets better as the game goes on. And Trey moved the team all the way down. They scored that touchdown. Uh, honestly, and it wasn't a good start for Trey, but boy, did he bounce back. And he looked really good down the stretch. You could see the confidence kind of come back. Man, it was, I was pretty, I was pretty happy with the performance by all three quarterbacks. Um, you know, defense had its moments. Uh, where they did have some good plays, have some bad plays. Um, so, you know, I can't wait to get into this tape for more in-depth analysis and we'll break it, all of it down. 
But the 49ers get their first win, albeit preseason. But it means a lot considering the circumstances and with how the boys played. I like it so far. Hopefully you can hear me over this crazy loud music. But Niners dub, let's go.